Good morning, brothers and sisters, boys and girls, vibrations of the mind of the one true God whose name is love. Thought I'd <clears throat> share a reading today. It's been a little while since I've shared any readings. A few people are asking us why I'm not doing it, so there isn't a reason. I've just haven't been sharing them. I've been busy as well getting up early for training as I'm up now, going down for a few rounds with Mickey and Jimmy, but I really wanted to spar this morning, but I haven't got a gum shield. And I'm too long in the tooth, far too wise and too handsome, really, to be uh, sparring with Mickey without a gum shield. It's just stupidity. He punches too hard, and um, my teeth aren't in the best condition, but I'd like them left in my mouth. So no sparring today, unfortunately. I'm going to go and buy a cheap gum shield. And we'll get some good sparring footage next week. I'll upload a good couple of rounds, good rounds, full rounds, not just clips anymore, because I'm not worried about what people see of sparring anymore, because I don't have any opponents up and coming. So we'll get a couple of rounds on and we'll put them up, full rounds. But I've already read this this morning and I'm thinking, dolphins, banquet. But I've got to remember this book was, you know, it's, it's an American book it was written in the States, so... Now, some of the terminology is a little different to what we use over here. But here we go. Righty ho, here we go. February the 10th. In recovery, our ideas of fun change. Basic text, page 107. In retrospect, many of us realise that when we used, our ideas of fun were rather bizarre. Some of us would get dressed up and head for the local club. We would dance, drink, and do other drugs until the sun rose. On more than one occasion, gun battles broke out. What we called fun, we now call insanity. Today, our notion of fun has changed. Fun to us today is a walk along the ocean, watching the dolphins frolic as the sun sets behind them. Fun is going to an NA picnic or attending the comedy show at an NA convention. Fun is getting dressed up to go to the banquet and not worrying about any gun battles breaking out over who did what to whom. Through the grace of a higher power and the fellowship of Narcotics Anonymous, our ideas of fun have changed radically. Today, when we are up to sit where we today when we are up to see the sunrise, it's usually because we went to bed early the night before, not because we left our club at six in the morning, eyes bleeding from a night of drug use. And if that's all we have received from Narcotics Anonymous, that would be enough. Just for today, I will have fun in my recovery. Yes, I will. My idea of fun is training. You know, if we forget, don't we, when we... Well, I did, you know, when I was using drugs for all them years, I forgot how good the gym made me feel. The gym training. Obviously, it's got the ability to release them natural feel-good endorphins and hormones will really give you a boost. You know, they make you, you know, good for your all-round mental well-being. You know, you get this level of energy that's sustained right through the day, especially in scaffolding. You know, it's hard work and your energy can die off after a few hours' work, but not when you've been training in the morning, especially a good early session. This is at 5 a.m. I'm getting picked up. Going down, I'm going to do five threes, some skipping and some shadow. We'll maybe get one or two little videos uploaded, but sparring videos, I think, are coming next. Um, and like I say, we forget how good that makes us feel. You know, it's easy to forget, especially when you're taking drugs, you know, how good natural highs can be. You know, feeling good is for free. Natural highs are for free. Training, sparring, running, whatever you're doing, lifting weights. I mean, it might cost you a couple of quid to get in a gym, but the feeling that you get... You know, it's for free. You know, that feeling that you get of training. You don't have to go in a gym. You can run, you can train, you can do a pad workout in your bedroom. And all of these things make you feel good. They all set you up for the day. Take it from me, you know, they set you up for the day. They give you the sustainable energy. Um, big shout out to the fellowship. Love everyone in there. Uh, it's brilliant. So like I say, it's... To progress you know sometimes this recovery this feeling good is like two steps forward one step back two step forward one step back that's still progress 
You know, and sometimes you feel like you hit a bit of a stalemate. You feel like you're not really progressing. You're not feeling any better. You know, they should because you've had this honeymoon period of recovery where everything's amazing, everything's falling into place. But then, you know, you get it goes not doesn't go a bit stale, but you know, you feel like you're not progressing, but you are. You just don't realise it because you were progressing so fast so soon at one point. You know, and that just slows down a little bit. Sometimes it speeds up, sometimes it slows down, you know, that's recovery. Um I love being in recovery. It feels brilliant. Um I think I'm gonna leave it there. Uh, we might get a couple of videos up of us in the gym. We might not. There'll be a few videos tomorrow going up with our Bobby K. So I'm looking forward to that. Looking forward to meeting Bobby K and Uncle Taz, having a drive up the road to uh, Aberdeen. I'm finishing early work tomorrow and I'm going over to Newcastle to pick a cheap little car up. Then I'll be uh, traveling about all weekend, doing bits and bats. Looking forward to it. All right, have a happy Thursday, everybody. Make today your own. You know, gratitude lists, readings, prayer, prayer or prayers, um, yeah, training and all these things you can do to make yourself feel good. Um, bye bye for now.